Hi guys, Super Sam here again. Welcome to another episode of How to Do Earth. And in this very episode, I'm going to show you how you can automatically drive a wheel using drivers in Blender 2.80. So let's get started. <music> So I have joy in my scene and I would quickly want to turn off the hair particle in order to make my scene respond faster. And in addition to that, I also want to turn off the environment collection. Okay, so now I have joy. This is my rig and I'll quickly explain how my rig works. I have a control here called foot IK, L for left, and I have another control here called skate L. So when I move the skate L control, you notice that the feet is left behind, or G to go back to the default position. But when I move the foot IK, you can see the foot is moving along. And not only the foot is moving along, I also have the wheel rotating so this is what we're going to achieve here in the video but currently we have all the four wheels rotating and when i delete this you can see that every other wheel is rotating except for this wheel so let's build the drivers together the first thing I want to do is make sure I understand how I want the system to work. I want the tire to roll along the X. Yeah, I want it to roll along the X, okay? And I want the movement along the Y of the foot IK to control the rotation of the wheel and mind you i want this movement to be in the local and not the global so the local direction y should control the local rotation x so that said i'll click on the wheel and go to the x rotation right click and add my driver then here I'm okay with the scripted expression. Depending on what you want to use your drivers for, you can decide to change your driver setting type. So for this type, I'm okay with the scripted expression. And here is my expression for the script. I'm gonna leave it the way it is for now. And also change the variable. This var means variable, and this is where you can define your variable. So click on this and use the transform channel because I'll be needing the X rotation value. And here I'm being asked for the object, which is rig, in my case, rig, as you can see, rig. And also notice this purple color. I just want to quickly digress to tell you this. Anytime you see purple color in Blender, it means that particular attribute is driven by a driver. So right click and go back to edit to continue what we're doing. So I have rig as the object. And the bone would be the the foot underscore IKL. Okay, you can see from here, foot underscore IKL, that's the bone. So go back to edit driver. And I'm gonna change the space to local space and then click on update dependencies. So now when I move the feet, you can see Every other wheel is still rotating except this front wheel. And this is the problem. We didn't define the direction properly. Okay. So we have this direction. We have the X location set and we are supposed to set the Y location. But then I'm going to show you that even with this X location, it simply means that when we move the feet in the x direction is going to affect the rotation as you can see and this is not what we want 
okay so by moving these feet along the x direction we get the rotation here but this is not what we want so OG to go back and edit the driver and now change the x location to y location of the dependencies and as soon as you change to the y you can see the wheel moving but there's a problem though every other wheel is moving in the right direction but this wheel is moving in a counter direction and we don't want that so how do we fix this problem simple just go back to the edit driver and um, you change your expression here to negative so I'm changing the variable to a negative value which would affect the result I get so by the time you move this now you can see everything works correctly so this is how you can automatically drive your wheel in Blender 2.0 using your drivers. And um, don't forget to like the video, subscribe to our channel if you've not done so, and share this video with your friends also. So until next time, keep your creativity blending. And I still remain Super Sam. See you in the next episode.